I guess this means it's gonna be a boss slash enemy rock stage. I'll definitely take this over Cutter. So what are the tasks gonna be related to like not taking damage from the bosses or doing specific tasks while fighting the bosses or something? Guy for the second phase, he's like, Oh, hey, I'm gonna chase you with my freaking shield. I'll attack you from the back, douche. Boom. Now, should I go in the hole or should I move forward? Which one is the trick path to take that you don't want to take? What's the point? Oh, hey, fight the boss, but we'll give you sword in this any freaking way when there's always been a. Oh, hey, fight the boss, you need the boss ability. If you don't get it, you'll freaking miss something for 100% completion. Also, I wouldn't be surprised if this thing to remove that poster. I'm definitely getting that. That'll be bo five boss slash enemy for the skirmish thing is in two, uh... Yep, oh, four wanted posters, okay. But each freaking Slight will correspond with one of the hidden wildies. Kind of a safe bet, but anyway. Um. Honestly, hammer's normally better than sword, and even though it may do more damage, I prefer sword over toy hammer. Watch you be an enemy skirmish next, and not a freaking boss. Hey, it's the freaking boss that is reminiscent of freaking. Pokemon, Douglas, and Swana. Maybe something is... takes some work, but simple in terms of, like, idea and that it's like, take, like the bosses without taking damage. But now one is four wanted posters, so... Oh, come on, really? They're both time. Oh, speaking of, 
Mebo. For now, but drop it down in case I want it for health, even more. It's kind of hard to avoid dying in this game, at least for the main part of it. Maybe not the freaking boss stuff. <clears throat> what the heck? Four soda shots left. If there's a hidden poster in this room, or if there's a wanted poster in this room, I have no idea where it is and it's evilly hidden. Maybe up here on top of these up. Oh, okay, I'm glad I noticed that. Nearly missed it. upgraded yet. Nope. Either this or bomb, I'll take this. Here, wanted to go over here in case there's like a hidden wanted poster or something. Watch one of the two of the other tasks be freaking revolve involving something to do a specific task with one of the bosses or something. I swear they make you freaking freeze that freaking tornado boss again. Blue arena or whatever it's called. Oh, car. Interesting. Puzzle. Stupid crap.
Okay, let me do this to make sure I don't miss it. Wanted poster, what's the third one? Come on, stupid lagging bull crap. Okay, the tornado room. This is freaking bull crap. Okay, I got it. Just need to make sure. Cross the ice blueprint. Okay, let me check that. Where's the fourth poster? I would have ended up going off to the side like that.
There's the last wanted poster. I bet anything the two other freaking tasks are having to do with freaking specific stuff you need to do with the boss that says just don't take damage, use a certain ability, or freaking freeze for Florina. Beat one Frosty without getting hit. Well, what the frick is the last task then? I had a feeling they might do that with freaking Quinn Frosty. I don't know if that's 23 Wileys total or 23 Wileys specifically from this level. Yeah. Okay, I yeah, should now. Let's see the uh, treasure road. Search the world for the world map for suspicious, suspicious places. So there's two hidden ones that I'll eventually find on the world map. And that'll be another thing I do off screen. So actually, I'll return to wild. I will return to wild E Town now to freaking upgrade ice. Flash fishing, try to land some big catches. Don't need to buy those because I've got an evil to give you those. Do I have enough of the frickin' things to upgrade both abilities, or do I need to be able to do do, 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 do I need to do more of the frickin' challenge stages to do some of them? Yeah, all two of them. Let me see, check ice first. It takes two fire. It's gonna take at least three, if not four. Three, yeah, I've got more than enough good. Uh, maybe TMI, but I need to freaking put my shirt on now. Uh. Normally I skip it, but for this one I'll let it play out just because it's probably one of 
X amount of abilities that had the legendary version. Okay, I get fired. Special dialogue, I assume. I'll do three on this one. Okay, so now... Okay, one, I'll do ten. I'll do it to 15 now because of all these repeats. Six. Grace, elegance, beauty, and brutal attacks. Pull your enemies into a flurry of feathers and turn battles into sophisticated ballets. Out. Hurts almost as much as point shoes. Those be pointed shoes? What is point? It's not point. Poignant shoes, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, even if it's not seven, I'll say that's seven. Eight, nine, ten. Blue Arena always puts on an elegant show when she attacks. Don't get too caught up in her performance, or you'll get caught in her tornado to mash. She's very dedicated to her dance career and thinks of every battle as a new lesson. They keep her on her toes. Har har. Nine. And 11, 12. Wonderia was named after its founder, an author who wrote stories about a dog that explores outer space. Those stories became incredibly popular and were later used as the basis for the Wonderia theme park, a land of dreams for kids of all ages. Get it? Because it's dreamland? Ha ha. Anyway, I'll say this is 11. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and I'll do four more for good measure. Sure, this may be the cutest bonk to ever block a block. <laughs> This is no plaything. It has rapid continuous attacks with enough hard hammer stakes and crush enemies. Okay, three more. One. Two. Cut order of fries. It's actually, that's actually what it's called. The most experienced of marksmen requires the fanciest of hats. Fire barrage of shots with dual wield 
did pop guns. You can release a fur flurry of shards shot to view view. Never thought of that being similar to Diddy's peanut pop guns from Donkey Kong 64. Okay, so three more and then I'll get out of this. Pony spiky clutter all whirled up into a ball, it's needles upon needles. What a powerful weapon. Roll forward then release to send sharp clutter flying out around you. Ouch. Okay, three more. One. Two. And last one. Oh, regular hammer, Kirby. That's in volume two, interesting. A sturdy hammer with intense attack power. Your reach is short, but it's worth it to block enemies and stay and stakes. Hold the button to charge, then let go to do a hammer flip. Okay, done with this gotcha crap. For now. I was just saying, back to the beginning, this is stupid, but anyway, the Battle of Blizzard Bridge. Yeah, I'll be hooding through this three times to figure out what the last stupid task is. It's apparently after something after the frickin' twin ice guys. Not unless it's all you're supposed to find two things, and I have no idea what those stupid things are besides the wanted posters. If I don't end up being able to beat the freaking Twin Frosties with this without taking damage, then I'll freaking. Go ahead and, uh. Also. Well, first get rid of him. And then Amiibo. Freaking douche! I wonder if maybe the last task was to go through the entire stage without taking damage. Now that I think of it. stage within a set time period that could also be the frickin last challenge or mission I'm hoping it's a fast one and not to beat the entire stage without taking damage
Damn it! Well, I like being able to freaking destroy the enemy super fast. I need to go with the more sure. The ability to the more sure fire away. No fire pun intended for me to make sure that I don't take damage against them, and that is to use tornado and have the freaking stage take longer. Take a detour and find a maximum tomato. Fresh ocean air and warm sunlight help tropic woods grow big and strong. It's giant coconuts will cause big explosion that they drop it has. Not explosion coconuts too, and they're supposed to be delicious. Few have ever tasted them, but many have tried. <laughs> I'm just gonna go through the stage that I get tornado from Florina anyway. Freaking douche. I damage them with the frickin' snowballs, the one throws. Juice.
Well, you guys get the idea of how to do it though, just use Tornado to avoid taking damage and also use the Star and Crap to do more damage than to be able to do it. So I'm gonna end up freaking doing this task as well as the ones in the other stages off screen. Besides the maximum tomato one, I'll freaking bulk that up in just a bit here. Stupid damn crap. <clears throat> And for my own sake, now that it bothers you guys at all, but I have to, unfortunately, wait on being able to do anything beyond stuff with this stage, uh, and, uh, well, the Maximum Tomato thing at this stage, until after I do other freaking things, after I'm done with finishing er, this, this recording session. Yeah, I wasn't gonna want to, but I'll split it into three videos. I was gonna do two, like, 45 minutes a piece, but not now. Stupid damn twin frosty task. I nearly freaking had it too. Anyway, I looked the freaking thing up. Take a detour. How do you get to this stupid evil ball crap? Of course it's at the freaking beginning of the city. You've got to be kidding me. It's the last task in the list, but it's at the beginning of the stage. What kind of bullcrap is that? You guys don't need to freaking sit through the Kirby dance and all that. So that's it, guys. That's it for this video. Hope you guys all enjoy these videos, and I'll see you guys next time. Well, let's play Kirby in the Forgotten Land for me showing off the video captures of me doing the tasks in the previous stages, as well as the end of me beating the freaking Twin Frosties in this stage without taking damage. And after that, I will be at least starting should be able to in the next recording session hopefully be able to get all of them done but at least whether or not i finish them in the next session i will be doing the challenge stages of this level so once again i hope you guys all enjoyed these videos and i'll see you guys next time for let's play herbie in the forgotten land for the challenge stages of world four bubble four i mean bye everybody